Tonight, the Anago School Board met to discuss mask policies in the classroom once again. Thank you for joining us. I'm Rashad Williams. And I'm Natalie Sapaila. News 9's Adriana Daniel is live in Anago with a closer look at the decision made and reaction from parents. Hey, Adriana. Hey, Natalie. The Anagos Board of Education held a special meeting tonight to discuss proposed changes to the school's mask policy. One parent said the school board does not have the right to impose a mask on their child. The proposed change to the school's mask policy included making masks required for all staff, students, and visitors when in the school. Board member Jim Maddock Nelson proposed a counter resolution that would allow those who have been exposed to COVID and are asymptomatic but have not tested positive themselves to stay in school with a mask on. It chose to provide a different resolution that just simply looks at our local district data to identify barriers to academic achievement. Nelson says the goal is student achievement and keeping kids in the classroom. One community member saying Nelson's resolution is a non-starter and the way to keeping kids in school is by requiring masks. And if they're wearing masks in our school, there will be the ability for them to remain in school. So you're actually in a situation where we're going to keep more kids in school. No decision has been made at this time, but the board voted to postpone the decision and possibly meet with members of the health department to make their decision. As of now, Anago students are still allowed to choose whether or not they will wear a mask in the classroom, but the board may bring up the mask policy again later. In Anago, Adriana Daniel, News 9, WAOW.